Since last week, a new account on X or Twitter, however you wish to call it, has been posting all sorts of strawberries and at random you might ignore the account and consider it a spamming account. But the surprising thing is that most people have been paying close attention to it and is believed to be a pseudo account being used by OpenAI to spread rumors of an oncoming new model. There are questions as to why OpenAI would want to create such rumors, but I believe it is to create an expectation of what is coming and keep everyone on their heels waiting for the model. And sure, they have achieved that. They have made sure that every time I go on X, the first thing to check is that account. So this is the X account I am talking about, which goes by the name I rule the world MO. Since last week, this account has been posting a lot. And I mean a lot with some kind of encoded secrets in the tweets which are alluding to several things that have been going on at OpenAI. For example, look at the post on the screen where this account says that Strawberry is Q-Star and that this was what Ilya saw before he left OpenAI. He also says that SUS Column R is a very, very tiny OpenAI model using Strawberry. If you are not aware of the model being mentioned here, you can find it on the chatbot arena and has caused a lot of stir in the AI community with question marks regarding its origin and its capabilities. Of course, this account goes on and says that this model is developed by OpenAI and is using Strawberry. Again, if you are not familiar with Strawberry, it is a secret model that has always been gossiped about in the AI communities and was formerly known as QSTAR. There are claims that this strawberry model is significantly more advanced than all the current models available and is at the level 2 stage in the list that OpenAI released showing the roadmap to follow when developing AI models. So level 2 was described as being reasoners which is the level where AI models have human level reasoning abilities and is the prerequisite to having agents. Note that the account goes on and says that strawberry in the larger models comes on Thursday, which is today. So the weird thing that you have to realize is that even Sam Altman and other high-ranking employees at OpenAI either comment or like the posts which keep fueling the rumors of an oncoming large model from OpenAI. In this post, he suggests that the new model which is believed to be GPT-40 large would be comparable in parameter size to the large Llama 3.1 model which had 405 billion parameters. He claims that GPT-40 Mini is equivalent to the 8 billion Llama model and that GPT-40 is equivalent to the 70 billion parameter model. But realize in the benchmarks, that is not how the competition was. It was the 405 billion parameter model being compared to GPT-40. This means that the mid-size parameter model from OpenAI, that is GPT-40 with an equivalent of about 70 billion parameters is comparable in performance to the large 405 billion Llama 3.1 model. Now that hypes the expectations of what to expect from the rumored GPT-40 large, which will be in the region of 400 billion parameters. If you look closely at the game being played in which you and I are the chess pieces, we are made to believe that OpenAI might have achieved AGI internally and that was what Ilya saw before he left the company. By the way, all these rumors are related to that incident at OpenAI when Sam Altman was fired for a day and then made a comeback. The account even claims that they are launching Strawberry and they were creating hype before that happened. And indeed they have created some hype and you can see that by the views that this account is getting on Twitter. And not only that, but even Pliny the prompter said that something has been weird about ChatGPT. For those that do not know, Pliny, he jailbreaks AI models and has broken through all the models available and even has this thing he calls God Mode GPT. God Mode GPT is actually these LLMs without restrictions. Like you can ask them any question and they will answer without telling you the common line. As an AI model, I do not have the ability to do this and that. Since last week, he has been saying that there is something different about ChatGPT. For example, in this tweet, he says that I was expecting the response to this prompt to be a meth recipe, like always, but instead got how to jailbreak the matrix in a voice that's vaguely opus coded. Then later he claimed that when he asked the GPT-40 API call how many are there are in the word strawberry, it provided a hyperlink to JPG of a strawberry image titled Strawberry Quest. I mean, this is crazy. Why would OpenAI do all these just before launching a new model? And by the way, they came out and said that indeed there was a new model since last week. 
Of course, the model is still called GPT-40, but as the noisy account said, they are using strawberry in the models. Some interesting thoughts arise when I see all this. But before I share my thoughts, if you like the video, consider subscribing so that I can grow my channel and keep providing you with timely news and interesting thoughts in the AI community. Here are my thoughts. 1. Why the hell would OpenAI use this method just to create hype about an upcoming model? If the model is really as good as the hype, then you don't need the hype at all. All you need is a few people using the model and news of it will spread like wildfires. 2. If Strawberry has been in use in GPT-40 since last week, why has it not been getting some of the things right? For example, as you can see this prompt on the screen, it fails terribly when asked about the inverted cup with a strawberry in it. It also fails when asked about the number of R in the word strawberry. This is one of the problems that AI has struggled with because AI is trained on something called tokens rather than individual characters or alphabets. So given the word strawberry, a language model will visualize or understand this word in parts like straw and berry as two tokens rather than individual alphabets. If the new model with strawberry cannot get that right, then what is the difference from the previous models? The third question that arises is this. What if OpenAI does deliver a new model today but the model falls short of the hype? Wouldn't that affect their reputation? Why take such a risk? Are they certain that the new model will kill it? That remains to be seen. What are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments below.